Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. And yes, today is the day we are telling the story of Mischief Night. Okay, so if you've been watching for a while, you might remember these couple videos I've made about some neighborhood kids who are stalking and harassing me. Well, turns out it's not just me and my family. They've been harassing this entire neighborhood for quite a while now. So even though in our last video, the mother said, don't come back, I just knew those kids were gonna be back. And sure enough, I was right. But this time I was gonna be prepared. I spent time setting up spotlights in my yard, shining in every direction as to make sure that there's no darkness for these kids to hide in. Cause I knew they would come in and if they were gonna cause mischief, it was gonna be hiding in the dark. And I started getting nervous as the sun was setting. I was like, I have to go home and start setting up. So I'm putting up all the spotlights. And sure enough, just as I'm putting up the spotlights, the kids ride by on their bikes and they're basically mocking me saying this. First thing I want to address is they're saying I'm cheating, but like, what do they think? Is this some type of game to them? Harassing people and bullying people? Is that like a game to them? I don't know. Maybe these kids are just mean. I don't understand the mindset of a bully. But what I can tell you is that no matter what, what they're doing is unacceptable. Uh, also, they're calling me. Pussy. Meanwhile, they're the ones running away. So actually, they're the real. Pussy. Just being honest. I'm gonna move on. Now as they walk by, I'm standing up on my porch. I just thought it would be funny not to say anything. So I just stood there like this watching them and as they, they stared back at me and I stared back at them and they knew I was gonna be keeping an eye on my house. Oh, so now here's a video of them walking behind my house. But little did they know that actually I was hiding right behind that fence over there with the hose in my hand. And if they're gonna think they're gonna do something to my property, I was gonna spray them. Now, the one moment I stop looking in the front, they do come out onto my front yard and try and TP my house. And of course my mom comes out and goes, hey, what are you doing? And then one of the kids threw this roll of toilet paper and this empty can of silly string at my mother. So that's right, he assaulted my mother. And my mom actually took another roll of toilet paper from one of the kids. And as he threw these things at my mom, he said, quote, I almost hit that. And it's like, um, wow. My mom told me, she was like, I've been nothing but nice to these kids and this is what they're doing to us. It's like, wow, like they're just nasty. But as I mentioned before, this is not the end of the story and we were not the only ones being harassed. They ended up TPing my nice neighbors down the street. So at this point, we were like, we've had it. Um, once you assault us on our own property, that is not okay anymore. That is no longer harmless. That is against the law and just not okay. You don't assault people. So me and my dad hop in the car and we track down these kids halfway across our town, still riding their bikes, still having foul mouths and still harassing other people. That's the, Daddy, this is all the kids. That's, that's the... That's yeah, this is all of them. Okay. After that, we saw a lot of police officers scanning the streets. So we drove back home and we saw a group of three kids standing outside the front of our house and my dad and me confronted them. This is how the conversation went. Hello. What's going on? What you doing? We're calling our friend. Who's that? We're asking what you want us to do. That's harmless. Um, I know. I know. All right, boys, listen, have fun. But you know you're not supposed to be out of here past seven, right? Okay, so I'm editing this video right now and I completely forgot to mention that when we were just about to turn down the street heading back home, this cop pulls up right next to us and he asks us, have you seen a group of juveniles? So my dad goes, yeah, there's a few of them hanging out from my house. Uh, I did tell him though, you know, you're not supposed to be out past seven o'clock. Here's that video clip. After that, we saw this one guy walking his dog and we started talking to him about it. Turns out these kids were harassing him too. Yeah, I saw them before and they were like... And there's like 15 of them. Yeah, they were like mounted off of me until I stopped the truck and then they all took off. Where do you live? Right. right there. Oh, I saw you on your porch, I think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I wonder what he's doing. Yeah. yeah. Well, I, I saw you throw your hands on your hips. I was like, he, he must have scared some off some kids. I just told him, I said, a couple days ago, I had, listen, I was a kid once too, I get it. Stop ringing on my doorbell and running away. The kid yeah. rides right on his bike, fuck you. Fuck me. Oh, now, yeah. yeah. Now well, I mean, this afternoon, I came out of my house and made a right. And they're all sitting there right in the middle of the Can street. Oh, be careful with her. But the guy was like, like, looked at me. I'm like, what the fuck are you doing? He's like, we own this street. Yeah. 
Yeah, I know. Imagine I out of my truck a bunch of nine year olds yeah. like said, with like, them a few years ago. Like, cool. You know, yes. like, like we're kids. Like sure. we, we were all kids. Okay. We did the same, you know. I but did. it's like. Have a little respect. What the hell? And, and then their mouths, I can't stand it. Oh, that's it. I, I know I was yeah. a kid. We were doing our little thing, like, and a dad came out and was like, oh, get out of here. Yeah. Look, these kids are like, they don't get us. They're around. Look at you. Yeah. What? Not only at his house, but they tracked him down at the place that he works and harassed him one day while he was working. They mouthed off to me here, and then I was working. I work at the and I'm working at the this afternoon, and I see them all go by, coming up, turning right, on, on top, right, taking up both lanes, yeah. right in front of the cop that's sitting there blocking traffic. And then two people in the place were like, oh, those are those kids that almost ran over, and they mouthed off to me. They told sure. me to fuck off. They told me to... Yeah, right. I was yeah. like, but I had fun with that. This, t tonight, what I do is I saw them, and I went back in the house. I put her in. I got my truck, and then I saw them going up across... Uh, up across the one street so i just pulled up behind him in the truck yeah and just sat there with the yeah. high beams on and following him. yeah and like a couple of them pe 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 peeled off and a couple of them just going and i just got right up behind them and i just kept following them so all right let's go all right yeah take it easy later. <laughs> bye so yeah these foul-mouthed bully kids have been harassing a lot of our neighbors and a lot of the other people in town for that matter by the way, these kids actually said to this guy, oh, we own this block. What the heck? Who do you think you are? You don't own this block, you're a bunch of kids. And we've been all living here much longer than you, so what the heck are you even doing here? So after that, the night ended. While we were talking to our neighbors who drove by, this whole group of kids were having a brawl in my neighbor's front yard, and my neighbor actually came outside and she was now supervising all these kids. And what do you know? Two police officers came and they turned on their lights. Oh my gosh, they got caught so badly. But anyway, here's that video. Oh my gosh! Ah! I'm not the parents. No. Okay. <laughs> I've been policing my own house all night. Guys. Guys. They're throwing eggs. Oh my god. Where do you guys live? There's literally two cops standing right there. Hey guys. We're gonna go home. We're gonna no, get Danny, you're a big one too. Wow. This is like days of this already. Shit, shit. So yeah, that's how the night ended. Um, the kids really didn't get in trouble. But yeah, that is all I have for you guys today. If you could please like, comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you don't miss another one of my new videos. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys again soon. Bye.